Howdy folks and good morning from Winsun Exhaust in SS3. As you can see, it's the first time the Terrano has come here and did a full check. They found a little bit of a leak, so we've got that done. I got these done over at Procas uh, recently because tonight we're going for a night off-road. This is not my event. I'm actually uh, joining another, another event, A Force 4x4's event. And I'm going to talk to the organizer and maybe for the next one, I'll open it up to you guys and you guys can come and join as well. Yeah, those with 4x4s in my, in my uh, viewership, my subscribers. So anyway, what am I doing here today? I'm putting in an S-Flow for, uh, for the Terrano and a new tip as you can see over there. So there's the S-Flow and uh, this is the new tip that's going to go in over there. Because this looks kind of meh, you know, one of those... I also changed the horns to the but I very seldom horn you know a very very seldom horn uh, sometimes I'll just beep because somebody at the traffic light is playing with their phone and they don't didn't notice that it's turned to green so I just beep that's it but sometimes when it's required you really need one of those what are you doing kind of horns and so that's what I got I just found something very very interesting uh, about the uh, Terrano and it has to do with the third brake light and I'm gonna need to climb up there and show it to you because you won't believe me if I told you I was wondering where the rear window washer is because this truck is uh, uh, has a rear wiper so where's the rear window washer would you believe it's in the third brake light over there I couldn't believe it myself when I saw it so yeah let me just show you now since I'm up here this is how you open the uh, tail hatch and yeah so look at all my stuff all ready to go so it's a charity drive whereby uh, we're gonna visit uh, uh, an orang asli camp and uh, what we're gonna do is we're doing a lot of donations in terms of food and uh, see I have to be very careful huh? if I fall down from here that's it no off-road drive so yeah I'm donating some clothes two bags of clothes some cooking oil uh, some uh, rice and some instant noodles some bihun siam so anyway this will be the first off-road I gotta be really careful at my age if I fall down from here it could be fatal even though it's only three feet off the ground <laughs> so there's the new tip that's going in and uh, this is all my camping stuff that's my bed that's those are chairs that's a baldi um, once i set up in the camp i will do a quick video to show you uh what it is and this is for um getting rid of monkeys no i'm just kidding <laughs> it's just it's just to you know hold up a fly sheet or something oh so okay here we go this i changed the struts i changed the hydraulic struts so it's very hard to push down so anyway that's the rear wiper and <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it when I saw it working. Crazy. So here we are at uh, Winsun Exhaust in SS3, my go-to place for exhaust work when it comes to uh, mufflers, center bullets, S-flows, whatever, even the tips. And uh, oh, check this out. I actually bought this for the Safiro, for the front grille of the Safiro, but it was too big. But it fit perfectly there. So nice so nice yeah so very happy with the Terrano I got a new number plate done also at uh, Procast because the previous one was yellowed and the funny thing is only a couple of the yellow, uh, letters and numbers were yellowed the rest was still white my OCD will not allow that to happen so oh yeah I got something in Bangkok as well just walking around and I I found this very nice emblem so yeah say hello to Kurigan that's the name of this truck and uh, 80s, 80s uh, if you grew up in the 80s and 90s, you'll know why. Tell me in the comments why I named this truck the Kurigan. <laughs> anyway, so, yep, that's it. Let me just do a quick uh, walk around for you. Lovely, lovely. I've always been very happy with the work done here. And uh, this is going to cost a couple of hundred, a few hundred. Uh, new center bullet, they had to um, weld a bit of the uh, piping at the back, it was leaking a new um, S-Flow and a new muffler tip just some aesthetic stuff for the Toronto. anyway take care you all thank you for watching 
and uh, I will do a video when I get to the off-road place. We're going in at night, so I'll only shoot tomorrow. Yeah, we're going in tonight. Take care, you all, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.